there's this shop in Amsterdam called the Bayenkorf. Uh, there are a few of them around the Netherlands, and they are sort of upmarket shops, it's, um, department stores. And right now, I don't, I never go there. It's, it's changed a lot. But way back when I first came to the Netherlands, I would sometimes go there to buy this or that, and you, you could get decent things. And they had um, something that occurred in the autumn, and I can't remember the exact name. I think it was three dollar two hours a dark or something like three crazy days or whatever. And things were, it was like a, you know, the people in England know the Selfridges New Year's sale. So it was something like that. And my partner had, uh, I don't know, she could, would get their newsletter, which was fit, real, a real newsletter or a little magazine. And I saw a bag then. I thought, oh yeah, I could do with that bag. So, of course, I go to the shop. <laughs> And I don't really like shopping. It's just kind of weird. So I went very early. And to my surprise, when I was there, outside the store were just hundreds and hundreds, and maybe thousands, primarily ladies of people that just, like, I don't know what they were all doing there. And they were just, it wasn't rowdy. They were just there waiting until the doors opened. I don't know what time that was. But when the doors opened, it was unbelievable what happened because... I don't know what it is about free stuff or cheap stuff and the human mind. It it just it's a bad combination. And I saw people who if you took a still photograph of any of those people, you'd say, Oh, it's a very decent lady, uh, a good solid member of the community. But once those doors open <laughs> it, all I remember is thinking, Am I crazy or are they crazy? There were people that would run and they'd grab every single article of clothing on a rack. All of them. Not sort of, se- no time to select. I'll just grab all of them and then I see what I do with it. You s- it was wild. And it, the noise and the blah, 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 it, it was the craziest thing. And I think if you don't, if you're not used to that, and trust me, I come from Nigeria. I've seen busyness in Lagos and Enugu and wherever. But I was not prepared for something like this. And I even think that this memory is somehow burned into my mind. It will never, there are certain memories never, ever going to go in this one. Like the faces and the energy, and it, it was, it was an, it, a serious experience. My one and only time going to that event in the Bayakov.